everywhere I go, e -e everywhere I go, play you everywhere I go. Put you on repeat, play you everywhere I go, e -e everywhere I go, play you everywhere I go. girl Gladys aka is that your hair and welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel welcome I'm so happy to have you here click that subscribe button tap the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my videos coming up and if you've been rocking with me for a minute what's up what's good welcome back so today I have a unit by sensational one of their new units from their kink curls and co line this is sensational stunna here she is right here on the stock card right Stunna does come with your typical cap construction, your two combs in the front, a comb in the back with adjustable strap. It comes with a deep center part, and I would say it goes back like a good almost four inches. It says it's a textured lace wig, which it definitely is, you can tell. It comes with baby hairs, and it says it has 100% premium fiber. And it also states that it's for all curl types from 3B to 4C. Let me give you a quick 360 and we'll get right into my pros. y'all let's dive into my thoughts on stunna starting with the pros first pro strap the pack is the style i really like these tussled curls these like loose waves on kinky straight hair i think it's very pretty it definitely reminds me of janet collection jode and quite a few of you probably saw when i did that review in that video i was focusing on how to make a wig look natural jode is definitely shorter and i really like jode for that reason her style her length and same goes for stunna i love that this falls like a good what is it like 14 inches on me i think it's the perfect everyday length this wig was in general very easy to put on i mean i just put it on my head i attempted to flatten down the top with my blow dryer off camera and i you know added my pressed powder with my bed head spray and i was pretty much done now let me just dive right into the cons real quick and it's actually a big con for me the main con to this unit y'all are the fibers so you'll notice that on the stock card it does not say that it's heat safe at all right and i knew this because i watched other people's reviews but out the pack it's definitely not ready to wear because it's very humpy and it's still a little humpy to me but i did the best that i could so of course i was using my blow dryer on low heat and it was doing okay but i did notice that i still burnt areas here i don't know if you can tell the texture difference but i can feel it like it feels crispy i just don't understand why we are still dealing with fibers that are not heat safe in 2020 like what's 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 that about when it comes to these wigs i i don't understand that when i first reviewed jode i really loved her for the style and for the fact that more companies were coming out with like textured wigs and i was so excited for that but would i buy joe again now in 2020 no i wouldn't and primarily because jode felt dry she definitely felt like she hadn't been moisturized in about a week i mean she felt like natural hair just natural hair that was dry as fuck so i feel the same way about stunna she is definitely a cankalon fiber and knowing what i know now and seeing that companies like outre have come out with natural textured units that are soft and feel moisturized i just don't see the use of these type of fibers anymore on these synthetic wigs now of course people still use cankalon hair for like hair braiding and ponytails things like that and i'm not against that i just don't want it on my wig when i touch this I mean, it, it feels like it's gonna catch on fire. Honestly, it does. Remember those packs of braiding hair that you get? It's like five for a dollar, five for three dollars, whatever the deal was at the beauty supply store for that weekend. That's what this hair feels like. 
I'd rather pay a little bit more for better quality. I actually tried out this unit recently by Free Trust. It's a natural hair unit. I will be showing that unit very soon. But that was like a similar texture to this, but felt like healthy, natural hair. So I just hope that at some point, companies get on the wave of having better fibers for these natural textured units because this one i'm not feeling whatsoever i just feel like in 2020 these wigs need to be heat safe period i need to see it on the stock card okay if not i just have a problem with that another contest unit for me definitely kind of i would say it's the cap size i do have a medium size head and this is fitting me very snug is it coming like ear to ear not quite i could pull this up some more but i just didn't i didn't care to i just feel like with a larger head it's it's definitely going to be snug on you overall i love the style of this unit and i think it's beautiful i am just i just can't get past the hairs that they use so i don't see myself purchasing another one let me know how you feel about sun in the comments down below how do you feel about this style on me would you rock her for the spring and summer months let me know look synthetic wigs have come a long way and i commend these companies for taking the steps for listening to feedback to try to give us what we want in regards to our wigs but you know these cankalon fibers you could save those for the braid in here you don't have to put it on a wig i think we're done with that in 2020. now if you are new to my channel definitely click that subscribe button tap the notification bell so that you don't miss anything coming up and if you want to see me in more natural haired units you guys i have a slew of videos of me in textured wigs i have an entire playlist dedicated to such so please 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 Check it out in the description box down below, as well as a ton of other information that you can take a look at, affiliate links, videos, etc. my playlist. And if you wanna see some of my latest videos, check them out over here to the right of me. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.